Here in the United States, we know that our democracy is not immune from threats. January 6th looms large in our collective conscience. And the anti-voter laws that many states have passed are part of an intentional effort to exclude Americans from participating in our democracy. In our democracy, in every democracy, a representative government is foundational and the right to vote is fundamental. And so ensuring every eligible American can access that right is a top priority for our administration and an effort that I am proud to lead. We know that the right to vote cannot be taken for granted. At every turn, it must be safeguarded and strengthened. And so our Department of Justice has increased its efforts to enforce federal voting rights laws. And our executive branch is taking further action to strengthen the right to vote. But executive action alone is not enough. Our Congress must act. Right now, there are two bills before the United States Congress, the Freedom to Vote Act and the John Lewis Voting Rights Advancement Act. Taken together, these bills would help to ensure that every eligible American can vote and have their vote counted in a free, fair, and transparent election. Today, as the world watches, the president and I reiterate our call for swift passage of these bills. We know our work at home will make us stronger for the world. We also know that the strength of our democracy is tied to the strength of democracies worldwide. And so we are equally committed to combating threats to democracy wherever they exist. Threats such as corruption, which corrodes public trust, fuels inequality, and can destabilize nations and entire regions. 